Welcome back to Arsenal News TV and today we're going to first look at Arsenal discovering minimum fee Sevilla will accept for Yusuf and Nesri in January and then we're going to look at Alexandra Lacazette's one word verdicts on Anthony Martial amid Arsenal transfer links. So the first transfer headline states that also discover minimum fee Sevilla will accept for Yusuf and Nesri in January. So the reports are stating that the Gunners are reportedly interested in the 24-year-old striker. Sevilla have set their minimum asking price for striker Yusuf and Nesri who is reportedly on the radar of Arsenal. And Nesri has been catching the eye for Sevilla recently and is being set for a transfer to the Premier League in January. And Nesri scored 18 goals in 38 La Liga appearances last season, just 23 of which were starts, and has two goals and an assist in five league games so far this campaign. The 24-year-old's goal tally in 2020-2021 was bettered only by Lionel Messi, Karim Benzema, Gerard Moreno and Luis Suarez in La Liga. The Morocco was brilliant in the Champions League too, where he netted six goals in eight appearances, four of which were starts. Also signed six new players in the summer transfer window, splashing out around £150 million on Aaron Ramsdale, Ben White, Takahiro Tobiasi, Nuno Savarez, Albert Sabila Koga, and Martin Erdegaard, but they could still do with a striker. The futures of Alexandre Lacazette and Eddie Ketty are both up and in the air at the moment, with the duo set to be out of contract in June 2022, and in terms of the likes of the Gunners having Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang, Gabriel Martinelli and Follerin Balogun on the books yet could be in the market for a proven goalscorer in January. If they want to sign a Nesri, then they will have to stump up at least £38.5 million which is €45 million Euros, according to Mundo Deportivo. The striker joined Sevilla from Leganes for around £17 million in January 2020 and is under contract until June 2025. The La Liga club, who are run by transfer guru Bonchi, are said to be calm about the situation given that they were previously rejecting an approach from West Ham in the summer. A swap deal involving Lacazette has previously been mooted in the Spanish media by Estadio Deportivo, also are reportedly happy to include the 30-year-old French striker in any negotiations for Nesri, but no, his inclusion would not drive down the asking price by much due to his contractual situation. Lacazette has been a peripheral figure at Arsenal so far this season, making just three appearances in all competitions. While he has scored twice in the Carabao Cup, he has played just 31 times as a substitute in the Premier League. The club centre was asked about Lacazette's future recently and said nothing has been decided yet. We discussed that internally and we discussed that with him. McLaws has said ahead of Sunday's low flooded derby against Tottenham. It's a long season ahead of us. Everything can happen. Everything is open. So it looks like also discover minimum fee Sevilla will accept full use of Nesri in the summer, in the January transfer window I mean, and this will be an interesting solve if actually also sign in. So this nicely takes us on to the second piece of transfer news, which states that Alexandre Lacazette's one-word verdict on Anthony Martial amid Arsenal transfer links. So the reports are stating that the French forward's relationship may help encourage a transfer from Manchester United to Arsenal, with fresh links coming out. Alexandre Lacazette's previous comments on Anthony Martial could be an indicator as to the type of player Arsenal would be getting should the latest Manchester United transfer links come to fruition. According to journalist Ekrem Kunur, the Gunners are lining up a move for Martial during the next transfer window and it looks like the likes of um, the move could be a good thing for both parties with Big Claw says are desperate to acquire some new firepower to aid his side's lackluster attack while 25-year-old Frenchman Anthony Martial remains unwanted at Manchester United following the return of Cristiano Ronaldo. And it is the signing that would likely please Arsenal's current French striker Alexandre Lacazette if his previous comments are anything to go by. Being international teammates for one of the biggest nations out there, composition up top is always likely to be hot. But speaking about his relationship with Martial and fellow forward Kylian Mbappe, Lacazette's one-word verdict of quality gave all the information fans needed to know. Very good. 
as it is in training. Like I said in 2017, when I asked about the, the relationship, we get along well. They are quality players, so it's easy to get along with these kinds of players. The coach gave us the freedom to occupy the three areas offensively and defensively. Since for greatness after winning the 2015 Golden Boy Award, Martial's full has fluctuated greatly during his time at Old Trafford and had created worth 7 goals in 36 appearances last season, has seen his stock fall greatly. But perhaps a fresh start at the Emirates Stadium, linking up with players he gets so well with Lacazette, will reinvigorate his talents. That said, Lacazette's future in North London is also under doubts, with reports suggesting West Ham, Lyon and Barcelona are talks to the 30-year-old whose contract expires in the summer. So it looks like Alexandre Lacazette's one-word verdict on Anthony Martial amid Arsenal transfer links. And when it comes to uh, Anthony Martial, we have a player that is a hit-and-miss player for Manchester United. We know that Mikel Arteta is capable of getting the best out of players. And when it comes to um, Anthony Martial, we have a player that is capable of doing good wonders as he has done it at certain periods of time for Manchester United. But with Mikel Arteta desperate to sign a young, hungry forward, he does tick all the boxes, but does he have the quality as Alex Audrey Lacazette mentioned in his one-word verdict on Anthony Martial himself? For me, when it comes to Anthony Martial, we have a player that is very, very, very um, weird in terms of can he c continuously do it? Can he be um, a very, very consistent player and I want you guys to leave it in the comments below should we sign Anthony Martial or should we not sign Anthony Martial we've seen how he is playing for Manchester United currently but is he the sort of player that we definitely need after having links to a variety of strikers such as Dusan Vlahovic players such as Lautaro Martinez he is a big name player but is he a big game player so this is something that I definitely want you guys to leave it in the comments should we actually sign Anthony Martial would this be a bargain transfer or would this be another one of those signings such as the Willian or other players where we sign the player and we know he's going to be bad and he does turn out to be bad. So we'll have to wait and see how Arsenal performs at the end of the season. If you want to see more daily videos from Awesome News TV, make sure you click the subscribe button, hit the like button so I know if you enjoyed the video and share the video to your Arsenal friends and family. Click one of the videos on the screen and I'll see you there.